Good morning. My name is Yosina Lisbeck, and I am the president of Safe Kids San Diego and the Drowning Prevention Chair. When my daughter was 14 months old, I received a call no parent wants to receive. She was at daycare, and there had been an accident, and I needed to go to the ICU at Children's Emergency Room immediately. What I later found out was that the daycare provider had put out a plastic kiddie pool that only had about one and a half feet of water in it. My daughter had toddled up to it, curious little individual, and she had gone A-frame against the side. Being a toddler, she couldn't pull herself back out. The daycare provider wasn't watching, and she breathed in the water, filling her lungs instantly. Unconscious and blue, the daycare provider found her, finally, in the pool. But simple steps save lives, and the daycare provider initiated CPR immediately, and that is what saved my daughter. Walking into the ICU, seeing my baby in nothing but a diaper, strapped down, sedated with all kinds of tubes, is an image I will never forget. But I was lucky. She was okay because simple steps save lives, and the daycare provider had initiated CPR. After the accident and my daughter had recovered, I decided something needed to be done. I was shocked to, deter to find out that drowning was a leading cause of accidental injury and death in children. How could I not have known this? I was a responsible parent. I had safety-proofed my house. I had taken her to the pediatrician for her inoculations. How did I not know this? I became involved in Safe Kids so that I could educate the community and parents about this. This, this injury that is so preventable. I started to work with legislation, which is the result of the Pool Safely campaign today. I'm so fortunate that here in San Diego, we have so many partners that work together to get this message out to the community. And I'm so fortunate that the Pool Safely campaign has come to San Diego to launch again a renewal of this education and community effort. Again, you're going to hear me saying it because it's important. A, B, C. Those are the drowning prevention steps that we need to take. A, adult supervision is a necessity around any body of water at all times. B, barriers. We need to put the barriers in. We need to have the alarms on our doors. We need to have the fences around our pools. And we need to have anti-entrapment filters on those drains. Strangely enough, when I was 13, my hair got stuck in a spa drain. I was foolishly trying to breathe from the bubbles on the bottom of the spa. Lucky for me, I was strong enough to pull my hair out of that brain drain. But unfortunately, there are so many children who are younger and who can't do that. Simple steps save lives. C, classes, CPR. It was CPR, that simple step, that saved my daughter's life. Let's do all we can to put these barriers and layers of protection in place so that our children here in San Diego and nationwide are safer. Thank you.